about this glare. I don't understand what's happening here. I wonder if this will help. Yeah, that did help. We are on our way to IHOP, finally. Every time we, every other morning when Curtis is out of work, we go to the Waffle House. The Waffle House is very good, don't get me wrong. They got good food, but you can only get waffles there. He thinks, mm -hmm, him right here, he thinks that IHOP is overrated, which he's not 100% wrong about, but they have more options. I want the Bacon Temptation Omelette, and he loves French toast, so you can't get that at the Waffle House. So we're gonna go to IHOP now and get some food. He didn't say good morning to our viewers. Good morning, everybody. He's still sickly. He's eating halls right now. Yeah, so we're going there and neither one of us got good sleep last night. He had a couple of jobs at work, so he had to keep waking up in the middle of the night. Were they actual fires or no? No? So he was getting nonsense calls in the wee hours of the morning and I was up trying to upload day eight, which was my birthday vlog. So that should be up. That'll be up before this one, of course, and it should be up by the time we get back. It's uploading right now. It was at 97% when we left, so it'll be uploaded and you guys will be able to watch that today, which is the 14th. This is Scott Miss Day 14. Can I just tell you guys about this coat? This coat, who's, who is this by? This is a Calvin Klein coat. And it is so hot. I'm talking about, you don't feel anything in this coat. I thought, why are you turning here? I guess this is one way. Um, I thought that it was like 60 degrees outside and it's only 40 degrees. 48 degrees outside but it felt like it was like 60 degrees outside because I was so hot with this coat on you I'm telling you this is the best winter coat ever and I got this from my grandmother she had this she had it in her closet my grandmother was a hoarder she just bought all things that looked nice all things brand new never opened she would just collect things and just have them so I got this from her and it doesn't let me down. I wear this all the time when it's cold and I'm hot. I'm always hot in it. So this is probably one of the best coats ever. Get yourself one of these Calvin Klein coats. Rex as far as like, who will get it from. We just came from Target. We uh, Got some Christmas cards. Thank you for the kids to give their class and like candy canes to give out. Now we're heading to Farm Fresh because we need to get some more fruit and I want to get some ingredients to make some pasta. We're back in the house. We just came from Farm Fresh. Got some fruit, got some grapes, apples, cherries, Curtis's favorite and strawberries and blueberries. So now they're complete with their fruit because they go through fruit. They eat fruit with every meal, so you can imagine how often they run out of fruit. I love this Simply Lemonade. This is my favorite one, the mango. I also like the raspberry and the strawberry one, but I seem to like the mango the best. We went to Target and got some cards for the kids to give out. If I can get it out of the bag. It just says Merry and Bright. And inside of the card it says, May your holiday season be jolly and filled with delight. Now let's see, what else? Uh, we went and picked up a couple of things. I can't show you guys because the kids might watch this vlog. But it it's for their room. That's all I can tell you. It's for their room. Curtis is in the back sleeping. Take a little nap before he has to get the kids. Forgot to show you the other stuff that I got from Target. I also got these Santa hats for the kids. 
I have to put them up somewhere because Gorilla think they're a chew toy. So he's been attacking them. And some candy canes. And I think that was it. And we got the, <clears throat> the Santa hats for the kids because they have... On Monday, they have to dress like a candy cane, so they have to wear all right, uh, all white and red. Tuesday, they have to wear pajamas to school, Christmas pajamas. And then Wednesday, which is their half day before the Christmas and, well, the winter break, the Christmas and New Year break. I have good old Pyrex here. I'm going to give you guys a little history about Pyrex. So... Pyrex has, wait, let me show you this shirt. By the way, this shirt, it's like this on all sides, so it's not holy. It's just the way it is. Uh, backstory on this Pyrex here. It has helped me get through two childbirths. I took this to the hospital both times when I was pregnant with the kids. And you know how the nurses come in, they tell you you can only have like ice chips. I gave them my cup and I said I want my stuff inside of my cup my measuring cup I use this for everything juice water cereal ice cream baking anything you can think of that's what I use it for so I love this thing and I'll never let it go it's been with me for like seven years now because I think I had it like about a year or so before CJ so it's about seven years anyway I'm gonna drink my Simply Lemonade that I diluted with water because it's too sweet. You know you're getting old when stuff is too sweet for you. And watch some Christmas movies. I'm not sure what's on the Hallmark channel, but I'm sure it's something good. And that's it. And do some Christmas shopping. I got to order the rest of the kids' Christmas surprise. I have to order the rest of it today. I can't believe we only have 11 days before Christmas. That's crazy. Today is the 14th. Scott missed day 14. So shopping and Hallmark movies. And I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Good guys. What are you watching? Give a message. I made spaghetti and some garlic knots and broccoli. I put cheese in it. That's the only way that CJ eats it is if I put cheese in it. So that's what I did. By the way, anybody else put ground beef and sausage in their spaghetti? Anybody? Or is that just me? I'm sure I'm not the only person who does it. That's why I'm known for my world-renowned lasagna. The key is to let the meat and the sauce simmer for like 45 minutes and all of the mixtures just work together. End of night, you found number 14? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, a red one. A gray one. Yours is gray? CJ, why don't you read what it says for us? Mug of cocoa, hot and sweet. The bears are having a special treat. Mm, hot cocoa, that's your favorite. Let me see yours. Ooh, you have gray. Well, silver. Yeah. Cool. Go ahead, enjoy it. Then brush your teeth and go to bed. You want to just end the vlog? But it's so we can have some oh, All right, yeah, you can have that. For looking at this video please like and subscribe hey kids we have here come over here cj we have to say a special hello to someone it's a dear friend of mine from my old job she's dedicated she was the first subscriber and she's always looking out so on the count of three we're gonna say we love you aisha okay one two three we, we love, love you aisha, aisha. Thank you for subscribing and being my number one fan. We love you and we appreciate you. And you guys have a good night. Did you say you, we love you, Aisha? <laughs> yeah, I did. No, you didn't. <laughs> Hold on, Aisha. Aisha. Curtis has to say something to you. All right, go ahead.
We love you, Aisha. Thank you. Appreciate it. We appreciate you, Aisha, and we appreciate all of you guys who have subscribed and watched. We love you and good night.